Hey friends of YouTube and subscribers, this is Reverend Tommy Two-Tone. Wanted to show you a couple of things. First of all, got my t-shirt from Mad Bad Voodoo. I'd like to say thanks to him. Awesome shirt. My wife kind of don't think I should wear it in public because I'm a pastor, but anybody that knows me knows I'm not a voodoo person. It doesn't even say that. I mean, she just don't get it. I'm going to wear it, by the way. Um, also wanted to show you, here's a knife that you will not see on the internet anywhere. This is from the 1992 uh, National Championship Alabama Crimson Tide team. This little pocket folder is a bear hunter. Uh, Pretty little knife. Had it for a long time. Okay. I also have a bear hunter commemorating the 1992 Atlanta Braves championship. Little commemorative knives. They're not very expensive knives, but now that uh, they're 20 years old, they're worth more than they were when I got them. Okay. And then I have this old timer that I've had since I was a teenager. Uh, I need to clean it up and sharpen it again. It used to be so sharp it's just been in a in a box. It's an old timer. It's got staghorn um, scales on it. Like I said, I'm 53. I've had it since uh, since the 70s. Okay, and then where is my oh this knife was my grandfather's. You won't see this one. You won't see this one very often either. This is a Senator Honest Abe. You can't see right down here on the tang it says Honest Abe. And it has a little statue of uh, Abraham Lincoln on the maker's mark. And here across the blade it says Senator. That's a very old knife. That was my grandfather's. He died in 1969. So uh, that was about 43, 44 years ago. Uh, so this knife is at least that old, but it was in his pocket when he died. And then my mom got it and she passed away and I got it. So uh, it's probably not worth a lot of money either, but uh, it's got a lot of sentimental value. So that's real staghorn as well. And then uh, a knife that I thought was cool because I bought it for 50 cents at a flea market little tactical dude. It is sharp. I mean sharp. Believe it or not, there's really no blade play either way. It locks up good. It's, it's got a spine lock. Uh, just tiny knife you can see. Just fits in my hand this way. It has no brand name, but, but it's just something. I mean, 50 cents just, just to play around with. Uh, this knife, I don't, I think, oh yeah, I remember. I found this with my metal detector on the beach. You can see it's been rusted. I've tried to clean it up some. It's a shrade, believe it or not. Um, it doesn't look like an expensive knife, though. The blade, like I said, it's all messed up. It's got three blades. Three bladed pocket knife. Okay. And then this, uh, it's a buck, that uh, cheap buck actually, but I got it at a uh, Dirty Santa Christmas party thing. Uh, everybody knew if there was a knife, I was going for it anyway. Nobody took it away from me, so that's a buck. Okay, those are just some things that were just laying around in a in a box in a in one of the safes in my house. But uh, anyway, that's it. All I got to say for now. Check you later. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. We're going to do some great outdoor fishing videos, other things coming up, cooking at the church. I'm going to be barbecuing this Saturday there, or actually grilling, not barbecuing, but we'll do some video from that. Uh, talk to you later.